If you're watching this, it's not a mistake. 4,000 meters deep, in that pitch black darkness where sunlight never reaches. Everything our biology textbooks taught us just collapsed. The scientific community is currently in a panic because oxygen levels are increasing in a location that has never seen light. This is as impossible as a dead body breathing. Today, we need to understand why trillion dollar companies are after these stones. I'm revealing what these mysterious generators at the bottom of the ocean are actually charging, and the great truth that has been hidden from humanity. If you watch this video to the end, you will never look at the world the same way again. I am Onyx Able, are you ready to dive deep? For years we were told that life comes from the sun. Plants absorb light, produce oxygen, and we breathe. But in mid-2024, in the middle of the Pacific Ocean, that law was broken in that cursed area called the clarion clipperton Zone. Professor Andrew Sweetman's team thought the oxygen sensors had malfunctioned. It's impossible, they said. If there is no light, there can be no oxygen. They repeated the experiment exactly 10 times. The result was the same every time, oxygen was being produced in the dark. Scientists called it dark oxygen, but that was just a cover name. The real question was not how oxygen was produced, but by what it was produced. These stones are the culprits. Polymetallic nodules. It contains cobalt, nickel, and manganese. But what makes them special isn't the minerals inside, but the electricity they emit. These stones generate exactly 1.5 volts of electricity. So the seabed is covered with billions of batteries lined up side by side. A single stone is nothing, but imagine that enormous circuit formed by millions of stones. Water is being broken down by this electric current. Hydrogen and oxygen are separating from each other. What we call natural stones are actually parts of a gigantic electrolysis machine. So, did nature place this massive machine there, or was it an intelligence that designed this planet millions of years ago? Why was this information revealed so late? It has actually been known since 2013 that these stones emit electricity. But someone covered up this information. Why? Because the global economy is currently running on the myth of green energy. We need lithium and cobalt for electric vehicles. And these stones are the world's largest cobalt reserve. Companies want to go there and dismantle these generators. But there's a problem. These stones allow the ocean to breathe. If you take them, the ocean will die. If the ocean dies, the world dies. This is not a mining operation. This is an attack on the planet's life support system. But what if there's something else consuming this oxygen? Science simply says, microbes. But a current of 1.5 volts is sufficient to power very advanced biological systems. Remember the USO reports from the Mariana Trench and surrounding areas. Those objects that emerge from beneath the water and are launched into the atmosphere within seconds. Perhaps they get their fuel from these stones. The ocean floor may be a graveyard for us, but for some, it's a massive charging station. While we survive up here under the sun, could another civilization down below have been ruling with this forbidden oxygen for billions of years? Let's dig deeper. 
if these rocks can produce electricity and oxygen it means the world is a machine a self-healing self-sustaining closed circuit perhaps dark oxygen is a flaw in this simulation a backup system that scientists shouldn't have discovered just like the fans inside a computer case we don't see those fans but they prevent the system from overheating these fans located 4000 meters deep have now been revealed if we tamper with this mechanism how will the system's managers react Perhaps the recent increase in natural disasters is a consequence of the imbalance we have begun to disrupt. Dark oxygen proved one thing to us, we know nothing about this planet. We know the surface of the moon better than we know the ocean floor. And now, we found a machine working in that darkness. Should we disassemble it and recharge our batteries? Or should we respect this ancient technology and step back? This decision may be humanity's last. If you enjoyed the video and want to see more of these deep mysteries, subscribe. Let's discuss this in the comments. Do you think these stones are a coincidence or a design? I am Onyx Abel. See you in the next in-depth report. Stay in the dark, because the truth is hidden there.